Hi guys, I'm sure most of you guys have already been using some sort of battery bank at some point simply because our phones uh, are prone to running out of battery where we don't have access to wall chargers and that's where battery banks comes into help. Now the problem is, just like a phone, power banks won't last forever and also needs to be charged when empty. It must be frustrating when you're carrying around an empty power bank you forgot to charge, right? Fortunately, Asus has been cooperating with Lockheed Martin to invent a power bank that could be used continuously for 5 years without charging, which is named the Asus Zen Power Atom. You should remember that this product is still a prototype and hasn't been sold on the market yet, so you won't find this stuff anywhere for now. As you can see from its name, the Zen Power Atom is a self-charging power bank that uses a radioisotope thermoelectric process, which is one of the most simple nuclear reactor systems. In this super small reactor, power is generated through a radioactive decay of a radioactive element. Then, the beta radiation and the heat generated through the process are converted into electricity. The radioisotope used inside the reactor is strontium, since it's more easily available than plutonium or tritium which are often used. This kind of reactor has actually been used on many spacecrafts on mission beyond the reach of sunlight, such as the Voyager which left the solar system behind, Cassini which flew to Saturn, or the MSL Curiosity which is driving around on Mars. On Earth, these reactors were also often used in remote places or places with limited sunlight, for example, lighthouses in the middle of the ocean. But just recently, Asus was creative enough to make a power bank out of it. In short, this power bank has two main compartments. One is the mini reactor down below and a 12,000 mA battery on top to store the energy generated by the reactor. The 12,000 mA battery is able to charge two devices simultaneously, either two USB-A devices or a single USB-A and one USB-C with Qualcomm fast charging. For example, a small phone like the OnePlus X can be charged up to four times continuously. Asus claimed that the internal reactor can charge your battery from 0 to 100% within 16 hours. So let's say if I deplete half of this power bank in a day, I just need to wait 8 hours aka overnight to fill it up again. Cool, right? So as long as it's operational life, which is 5 years, this power bank doesn't need to be charged at all and there's no possibility that this could be charged from the outside because if it's running empty, you just need to wait, wait until it's full again. So, cool, right? Hey, Mike. My battery is low. Can I borrow your power bank? Oh, sure, you can. Oh, my God. I forgot it in my car. Uh, it, it cannot overheat. Wait. <laughs> I know, I know, these things are simply too good to be true for now, but who knows, maybe in 5 years, 10 years, we will see more things like these. But one thing for sure, this thing already exists, this is an Asus Zen Power Max, it has a 26,000 mAh capacity, and it's also capable to charge laptops. If you want to see a review of this power bank, just stay tuned. If you think uh, this joke is just bad or you don't you don't find it funny, just leave a dislike. But if you like this video and the science explanation, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, have a nice day.